What's up, guys? What's up, guys? What's up, man? What's up with y'all, man? I'm just, as, I'm just excited. I'm happy. I'm happy. This is my first official YouTube channel. My first official video, and I'm a little, I'm a little hype about it. So before we start, I know y'all want to get right into it, but before we start, I just want to give y'all an intro about myself. This is my channel, Papa Mar. What's going on? The people that gave me the confidence to start this wave stuff, the people that I've been watching for the last 40 days, I want to give them a shout out. Shout out to Sir Cruz. I know y'all heard about these people. Sir Cruz, 360 Jeezy, and the 360 Wave Process. These, these are the people that started this for me. So that's basically my intro. Oh, also, my my YouTube channel is going to be basically about waves in the Navy. Because I am in the Navy, and I'm, I'm going to give y'all steps. If y'all do want to join the military, if y'all want to join the Navy, I'm going to make videos for that. So, that's it. And to end this intro with, I'm going to end it off by saying, I'm going to be the waviest seller in the Navy. And if you in the Navy and you got waves, we, we're going to shut it down. No, I'm going to shut it down. Y'all, you could be second, but I am the waviest sailor in the Navy. So without further ado, let's get this video started. Tom Philibar, Shingo. Um, I don't think y'all heard me. I'm going to show y'all how to do the wash and go method. So we're going to... Go do a wash and go method, come on. <sighs> I know I'm you I'm new to this, but if I'm gonna show y'all to do the wash and go, y'all gonna come with me, right? So come on. Come, come, come. Oh, I'm supposed to take the camera with me. My bad. Come on. We out. We out. Now before we start the wash and go, we gotta get all the tools you need to succeed in the wash and go. I say succeed in the wash and go. And these are all the tools right here. You need a brush. Now, it's two brushes right here for a reason. One brush you don't care about because your hair's gonna get wet. You gotta brush your hair while it's wet. Bam. Another brush is before we start the wash and go. You will be brushing your hair, and that's the next step. So, well, we didn't even start the steps, but that's step one, brushing your hair. We're gonna get into that, though. A comb. We're gonna talk about that. Conditioner or shampoo or both. It don't matter. This is the conditioner I got. Well, wifey got it for me. I just, if if you got a lady back on at home, you, you use their stuff, you know, we don't really know what the pit in our head as far as shampoo and conditioner, so. Ask wifey, ask your girly, they'll take care of you in that department. Bam. Container. Now, the container is used to hold water in it. Enough said. The rag. We want, I'm going to show you why we got the rag. Now, the mirror. Some people don't think the mirror is needed. Some people do. I'll show you why the mirror is needed. So now these are all the steps, well these are all, I'm sorry, these are all the tools you need to succeed in the wash and go. Now we're going to start at step one. Let's go. Alright man, I had to move everything to the kitchen because I wasn't feeling the lighting in the bathroom, but we're going to jump right into step one. Step one is to get some brushing. I got my good brush, I got my decent brush. I'm going to brush for 20 minutes. Now, if you knew, like me, 20 minutes is a good time. I know we got waivers out here brushing for hours and hours and hours. But 20, the most you brush is the better. Like, the more you brush is the better. But if you just want to get into it, just brush, brush 20 minutes. 20 minutes. So we're going to get right into it. I'm going to take the do-rag off. Y'all want to see what I look like. i only been waving for 40 days. So if y'all want to kill me in my comments, go ahead. But I think I don't look bad for somebody waving for 40 days. Hopefully y'all can see that. This is consistent brushing for 40 days. This is what you'll look like if you brush consistently for 40 days. I ain't get a haircut in a month. No, I'm planning on getting a haircut till January. Hopefully y'all can see my waves, man. I'm hoping y'all can see it. I'm getting to some better. All right, so like I said, we're gonna brush for 20 minutes. Let's get it, get this brushing up. Obviously, I'm gonna fast forward through this. But please do your brushing for 20 minutes. Put a timer on your phone. Play some music. Get your brush in there, man. Get your brush in there. The keys to waves is to brush, man. Brush. Tell me, y'all. 
Oh, hold up. I'm tripping. The mirror. And actually, I need to get back in the bathroom. But it's not my light and in the bathroom, not great. But with the mirror, you just look at your head. I'm going to back up a little bit. Just look at your head. And make sure everything connected. I don't know if y'all can see that, but just make sure everything connected. And then go for that pattern that you want. So if you want 360, you brush that type of way. I want the beehive. So if y'all follow me, y'all want beehives, then you just go on. I'll put a diagram. Uh, or I'll make another video and showing y'all how to brush for beehive waves. But you're just going to brush the pattern in your head. And this is what the mirror is for. And you just brush. Get your 20 minutes of brushing on, man. Get the side. Now, if you're in your bathroom like you're supposed to, you're going to look at the mirror. You're going to use your mirror. You're going to get this behind your head. You can get this behind your head so you can see the back of your head. And you're just going to brush down. I already know what pattern my head goes, so. The same. All right, this step two, you can get this water nice and hot. Fill it up. I don't need to really be filled it up, but you're going to get some decent amount of water in there. So you got the water in your bucket. Or your tougher wear ball, really don't matter. You're gonna get your conditioner or your sample. You're gonna get it in there. You're gonna mix it up. Mix it up with your fingers, it really don't matter. And after you do that, now this is where the rag comes in play. You're gonna get your rag, you're gonna put it inside, like, yeah, um, this is simple, man. Just soak that drink up. And you got the water mixed with the condition and your rag wet. Put that in the sink. So you're going to wring that bad boy out. And you're going to place it on your head. Just going to let it soak. Going to compress it. Get your hair nice and wet. And compress it. And I say do this three to five times, man. Get your hair nice and damp. You know, go through the motions again, man. Like I said, I don't want to waste too much time on this video. So it's a quick wash and go. Quick wash and go, man. It's a quick wash and go, man. It's my third time. I'm going to do it five times, but you can do it three to five times. You know? See my face a little wet? I ain't ring that out good enough. In fact, for the video's sake, it's gonna be my last time compressing it on my head, you know. And just make it go to pattern in your waves. I got, I'm going for the beehive, so. Just push it down, side to side. And we're gonna get into the next step, man. It's simple. So you did your 20 minutes of brushing. You can press your hair with the rag. Now the next step. This bad boy, you see it? Wave and spin. Oh, come on, zoom in. There we go, wave and spin. You're gonna get some of this. If you don't have this, it's cool. Get your conditioner. You're just gonna apply it on your head and brush through it. But if you got the wave builder, you're gonna open this bad boy up. Pin on that dome. Oh snap. I might have OD. Well, what I say about that brush, you don't care about. This is where it comes into play. Get that brush. Get that brush. Brush it through thoroughly. You don't got to OD with the brush. Just brush it where you can get it all through your head. This is my method of the washing show. Just brush it, brush it, brush it. Just brush it in there. You brushing it in, you brushing it in. The wave and spin, man. You brushing it in. Like I said, 
like what you did beforehand, when you combed and brushed, you do the same thing for this. You comb in there. Then you brush. Next step. It might get a little messy, so you can get in the shower if you want, or you can just wash it over the sink, in your kitchen, or in your bathroom. I usually do this in the shower, but for the purpose of this video, I'm just gonna do it over the kitchen sink. You're gonna rag up. Gonna rag up. And pin the comments, man. What, what do Ray y'all rock with? Y'all rock with them? Hold on. All right, my bad, it took me a little longer than I thought. But let me know what do-rag y'all rock with. Y'all rock with the Silky or the Velveeta? Just, just let me know, let me know. But for this purpose, and this wash and go, I definitely wouldn't put no Velveeta on. Now honestly, a pin on a cappy, that's what I call them little skull cap thingies. I call them a cappy, I don't know what y'all call them, but I must have left my eyes on the ship. It is what it is. That's why I got one of my pink do-rags on. But now I'm just rambling. So <clears throat> you you compress your hair with the rag. You got it wet. You got the wave builder on. This is basically like my replacement for a shampoo. So I usually put the conditioner on first, just patting it down. Then I use this as my shampoo, basically my wash and spin. This is by Wave Builders. I'll put it in the um, the description. So if y'all want to purchase this, I got y'all. So you did all them steps. Now it's time to wash this stuff out. So you're gonna put your head under the water, rinse, and just go to follow the pattern your waves, man. Simple as that. This is a messy, messy process, so I usually just do this in the shower. I'm mad my t-shirt all wet. I got the kitchen floor wet. <sighs> Alright, but the next step is to hurry up and wait. <laughs> and when I say that, you're just waiting for your hair to get, um, not dry, but damp. So, I'll be back. back. Hopefully your hair is damp by now, so we're going to uncover. Ooh. Let me know in the comments, too, if y'all... You know, y'all keep that cape out, or y'all tuck it in. You know, at night sometimes I just keep it out. You know, sleep like a hero, man. Feel like a champ. But during the day, I leave it. I leave it tucked. I rolls it up. All right, but let's get back to this. So your head damp. Take the do rag off. Show y'all what my head looking like right now. I think I might still have some. This in my head and shampoo, but it's damp, nice and soft. And now this is the time you spend on brushing and getting that connection, man. Your hair is real soft and it's pliable right now, so you're just gonna brush it in the direction you want. And as simple as that. After, <clears throat> cause I ain't gonna spend too much. Too much. I ain't gonna spend. Actually, I'm basically done with this video. Cause it ain't really much else to do. You want to brush your hair. I don't know if it's gonna zoom in, but your hair is real soft and pliable right now. So all them force you got going on, you try to get connection there. So this is when you brush for an hour. I repeat, you brush for a hour, non-stop. Brush for an hour. You just brush for an hour. Your hair is real nice and soft, so you can get it going in the direction you want. I'm telling you, dog, this works. I do this once a week. I've been waiting for 40 days. It took me 40 days to get my head to look like this. And I think it looks pretty nice, man. 40 days. And then just the beginning. Like I told y'all, I'm going to be, if not already, the waviest seller in the Navy, man. 
Like, I repeat, I am the wavy seller in the Navy. So, brush for out. The clock is ticking. We have finally made it to the last step. If you're still watching, please, 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 I truly appreciate it. Like, comment, and subscribe, all of that good stuff. So to end this off, you just put the do-rag on, you put a minimum two to three do-rags on, and you let it sit for a minimum two to three hours. After I do my wash and go, I usually leave my do-rag on the rest of the day. So I'm gonna show you my results in the morning. Like I said, please like, comment, and, and subscribe. Can't spit that word out. You're gonna realize I'm bad with words. I can't talk. I talk my own lingo, man. But the video is over. You did every step like I told you. You followed me through the whole video. I appreciate it, man. Papa Mar out. You will see the clip of what it looks like in the morning. Good morning now. We're gonna see his results. I ain't gonna spend too much time. Your boy gotta leave for work. All right, let's get it pop. I ain't even brushing that in. This is the straight off the do rag. But you see the results, you see how they looking. Everything came together nicely. Alright, I'm out, man.